All right, man. Let me speak about Maria Carey and um Brian. So Maria Carey and Brian, um, they have called a quit after dating less than for less than a year, I'll say. So Maria doesn't need no introduction. Um, very successful woman. I believe this will happen though. One thing that I know about successful women, they have bad habits. They tend to be, you know, not agreeable. I mean, I'll say maybe less agreeable, if not, but less agreeable, dominant, assertive, and very competitive. So those habits are not really um, something that men look for in a woman they want to take seriously. I believe that's what being those habits have been affecting Maria's relationships, even with Nick Cannon and all the guys that she dated before, even after Nick. So tomorrow, I mean, those are um, the guy that she just broke up with, Brian. Brian was 40 years old. So you can't, yo, let, let me just, let's just think, let's be logical, right? You can tell that at this point, at 54, Maria is having a hard time to find a man who's older than her. Because her, if she has to date a guy, that guy has to be at least, at least on her level, though. So she's having a hard time to find a man on her level. Financially, that's what I'm talking about. Financially, right? Why she's having a hard time? Because most of those men on her level, they're not checking for her, though. I'm not supposed to get rid of that. They're not checking for her because, like I say, she has those habits being dominant, being less agreeable, assertive, competitive. Your man on her level, they don't want a woman like that. Yeah, they must be smashed because she's still smashable. But they will not take her seriously because, yo, she has done hitting the wall. I believe... Yo, she's hitting the ground right now. She's hitting the you can't ground. Make this like, shit up. I'm a, yo, let me say this. I think it's over. It's over. It's over for her to find true love at this point. Fifty-four, having that success and the money, is hard for her to find true love. Though, she has two failed marriages. Marriages. One of Nick Cannon, the other one was when she was 23 with um, Tommy, who was, who was on the CEO of Sony. That guy was like 44 and she was like 23 at the time. Damn, man. Sheesh. <laughs> Sensation. <laughs> Yo, but anyways, let me go back to the topic. So, at this point, we cannot save Maria anymore. We cannot. Like I said, it's going to be hard for her to find anybody on her level. So, since she's more dominant, I, I believe she's dominant. She's a very dominant woman. I think Nick Cannon had an interview. She talked about those things too. She's competitive, all that. So, since she can find men on her level, that's why it will be best for her to date guys who are younger than her. Because Brian was, I mean, no was, but Brian is 40 years old, 14 years younger the gap is big though. And Nick Cannon was younger too. So, yo, if you're a woman watching, you want to be successful, that's fine. But just don't cultivate those habits because it's not going to help you in the dating market. And if you're a guy though, honestly, you're trying to find a woman. I don't see why you're going to go after a baby mama of two who had like two failed marriages. I get it. Maybe if in your 40s, no, not in your 40, my bad. If you are in your 70s, 80s, you know, you feel like, ah, you know what? I don't need no kids no more. I just want somebody to be with me until the end of my life. That makes sense. Yeah, you might find somebody like that. So I guess you guys can just share the last, you know, last years of your lives, right? But if you're young, you know, you guys, your blood still running in your body, Go get yourself some warm, soft, real, you know, feminine, young, tender, man. There's no point after going, going after baby mama's dog. Especially if you have a little bit of money. I don't see the point you going after 
I think this guy, you you might fall in love. We you know we seen it. We seen it with um Marcus with um Larsa Pippen. The guy is in love. He's whipped. He's in love, but I don't think they're gonna go that far. I don't think they're gonna go that far, though. Young Jeezy and Jamie May, they need work. Two failed. I don't know. Jamie May, yeah, two failed marriages. Um, we seen it with um, Dean Sander, with um, Edmonds. That's the the, the the woman's name, I believe, Edmonds. That girl was married to Babyface, high value man. After Babyface, um, no, I think Eddie Murphy came first, or one of one of the other, right? She was married to Babyface and Eddie Murphy. And now, she just got a divorce with Dean Sander, like, ha ha how oh, low can you go again like yo and she's like 56 maria's like 54 like yo this is mind-blowing like i don't know this woman because i'm african man i was born raised in africa so i barely see women in their 50 getting a divorce though like for me it's like shit, this is new i'm 54 but you know why because we live in a country that where Things are very easy. I mean, women can pretty much live without men because you can't live in an apartment if you have some issues. Issues you call the men's guy gonna do it for you. You have your own car. You know you can drive to the store. You can do. You have your job. You have a job. You can do whatever. That's why it makes it like that. But in countries where you know, um, uh, quote unquote third world countries, women are not behaving like that because yo the the, the the living survival mode you need a man next to you to survive though so a lot of things that we have in america i think we do take it for granted though we do take it for granted especially women nowadays you know i'll be watching shows i was actually watching a fresh and fit though um shout out to them you know they're doing that thing you know you know they might make mistake here and there but at the end of the day i mean they're doing salute to them they're doing that thing so i was watching them there was a woman who was saying this woman was saying that she would fight a man. I'm like, damn, man, you guys have it so good, dog. A woman fighting a man? I mean, I don't know, physical fighting? Are you talking about you having a gun shoot? Like, defending yourself different by fighting a guy, a man? Man, we, yo, we got it so easy nowadays, and we don't even know what all the people are dealing with in different places out there. So, to close this, I must say, hey, I don't think we can save Maria anymore, but good luck to her. Um, that's what I have to say. Other than that, I'll catch you next on Peace Out, family. I'm out.